Well, happy Monday to you. Welcome to the vlog. makes jewelry and these are some of the items that we photographed just a few minutes ago didn't take a few minutes we just stopped a few minutes ago <laughs> for a photo shoot. You hear what I hear? It's a band, man. It hasn't had uh, bands outside since March. Wow. Check them out. Quarter, the quarter the quarter's definitely busier. It's still kind of peaceful, though. Oh yeah. <laughs> she said, are you vlogging? Yes, I am. Well, this is the first time there was a live band outside. I'm surprised actually, because our lovely mayor is not allowing any live music at events or outside. So it's kind of nice to have a band out here, man. It sets the tone for downtown New Orleans. Absolutely. Hey, look, I am at the park waiting for my senior that I need to photograph in a little bit. So I have my laptop out here and the jewelry from earlier, that black um, little mannequin felt, you know, neckline that the necklaces are placed on. The dust that shows on that is crazy. I mean, anyway. Instead of doing the healing brush and going ahead and hitting all those dots, there's a little filter called the median blur. And this is the absolute best thing I found on retouching uh, creases in a paper roll background, um, dust on stuff like this, things that need to just be smoothed out quickly without all the work. You gotta see this, you ready? To the computer. First thing first. The image is there. I want you to go, go, filter, noise, median blur. When that comes up, you set the parameters to how much of this filter effect do you want to see when the opacity is at 100%, okay? Hit okay. Now, in your history panel, here's the key. In your history panel, go back one step go to your history brush, then go back to your history palette, click on the median blur for your history brush, okay? Then make sure your brush is set to normal and 100-100, and go ahead and brush away. Look at what this thing does quickly. Um, I had like 50 of these images to throw in Photoshop and retouch all the dust. And because it was black, doing the work didn't take long per image at all. Um, it, it took me a while for 50 images, but per image, it was super easy. Um, I can lower the opacity when retouching skin, definitely background stuff, and wait till you see what it does with your image that you're working on. Use it on the sky, use it on anything that you need to go uh, smoothing out Instead of using the healing brush, try this first for all of your small artifacts that you want to get rid of. Isn't that cool? All right, I think she's here. See y'all tomorrow. GK out. <laughs>